Good day and welcome to Motor Rose Music. I am Jeff Thiel, the host of the show. And today, it's a first here on Motor Rose Music, an unboxing. As you see, I am sitting behind a box and you will be forgiven if you've never heard of West Creek. Yes, I bought a cheapo on Amazon. This uh, currently going for $219.99. Um, I had a $40 off coupon. That's why I pulled the trigger. I got it for uh, buck eighty. That's $179.99 to you and me, kids. Uh, so this particular guitar is uh, meant to look like I don't know if it'll play like, but meant to look like a Gibson ES-335. Now it says 333, so this is a West Creek 333. Gibson did make an ES-333, but most of us know the 335, and that's pretty much what this one looks like. It's got the block inlays. We'll have the pictures up and show you, and of course I'm going to unbox this thing. I've already busted the tape off, and what I'll do is I'll cut and take it out, and then we'll pull the uh, styrofoam off it but so let me tell you about this thing it is semi hollow I did get the green one there's a green I believe you're like traditional cherry or a, a red color some sort of red color and a Pelham blue which I wanted but the coupon was not available for that it was available for this green and I am a cheap bastard so I went green and it's actually it looked pretty cool we'll see what it looks like uh, once I take this thing out. But uh, anyways, semi-hollow. It's got a rosewood board, which is kind of nice. It's not uh, laurel or... Well, that's the only one I really don't care for. And it's not for the way it feels. It's really for the way it looks. It's kind of... It's just too light looking for me. Uh, it's got two humbuckers. Your, you know, chrome covered humbuckers. Uh, and it's maple. It's all maple uh, body and a maple neck. Uh, if you hear some clanging going around, I let my dog walk around here in my uh, studio. And anyways, maple front, back, sides, and a maple neck. Uh, I'm assuming the headstock is um, maple as well. It has a tunematic bridge and a bone nut. Not something you always see on a you know a, gar a guitar that's $220. Uh, again, I got it for a buck eighty. Anyways, let's get this thing out of the box. Let's see what it looks like, and then we're going to hear what it sounds like. I'll put it through my uh, Fender Deluxe Reverb. Uh, it's the silver face, and uh, we'll mic it up. I think I'm going to definitely do a, a 1SM57, and then I'll grab uh, one of my, uh, <coughs> uh, my pencil mic, and I'll put it in there uh, somewhere. I'll probably distant mic it with that. Anyways, let's get this out of the box. All right, so here it is in the very, very high-tech and stylish styrofoam, as I like to call it, the styrofoam condom here. Let's keep it protected. So here it is, the West Creek 333. Hopefully this isn't making horrendous noise in green. It's a nice uh, translucent. You know, um, let's make sure it's uh, focused there. You know, this thing is a pretty good looking guitar. I'm going to take a peek at it here. You know, as I look this over, Oh, that's styrofoam. Man, this thing, I'm going to have, I'll have pictures of this, but damn if it, you know, it's a, a it's got a bit of a carve, a bit of an arch to it, front and back. Um, you know, it's semi-hollow, you know, of course, uh, binding around the body the and the neck and inside the F-holes. If you can see, it's, this thing's probably going crazy trying to focus on both of these, but, uh, yeah, I mean, it's got block inlays. Um, the back of the neck is, I don't, I can't tell if it's green or black, a dark green or black. I think it's black, but it would have been nice to have uh, 
you know, uh, a matching neck, but, I, you know, I paid $180 for this. Almost in tune, that's pretty good. I thought they would have detuned that, so. But, uh, yeah, I mean, it's generic tuners. These aren't, they're, whoops, they're Grover, you know, wannabes or lookalikes. Uh, not a bad looking headstock. You know, again, I'll have a picture of this. I'm not gonna, this camera's going crazy trying to focus. I got one of those new Nikon Z30, so I am in glorious 4K. Um, so, yeah, I mean, it's got the standard layout, the four knobs, two tone, two volumes, and the selector switch. Actually has a nice pick guard here. Uh, looks like it's a two or two ply, three ply. So black, white, black. And uh, yeah, just like, uh, just like a Gibson. You know, let's find out. Does it sound like a Gibson? Or does it sound better? Or worse? Find out next. All right, <clears throat> we're back with the West Creek. 333. All right, so I, I would like to say first off, uh, this is in no way uh, a sponsored video. I bought this myself. Uh, I don't have nearly enough subs that anybody's going to give be giving me free guitars. Uh, I, I bought this. These are my words. This is, uh, you know, my thoughts on this uh, particular guitar. And I will take into consideration that, you know, it's $220. I'm not a, gonna expect it to be like a $3,000 Gibson ES 335. Uh, but, I, you know, you don't wanna get a piece of shit either. So I, I have looked this over. I, I'm gonna tell you, the, the uh, fit finish on this thing uh, far exceeded what I thought it was gonna be. You know, pay, you know, I paid 180 for this thing. Uh, so I, uh, you know, the, there's no, I mean, you can't feel the frets here at, at all on this, this fingerboard. There's no sharp frets. Everything seems to be finished. Um, I can't complain about anything that I can see. So what I did is I got this thing tuned up. I got the string stretched out. Um, we'll see as far as tuning stability um you know how that goes um it's it's been pretty good since i tuned it up i tested it out i got try to get used to playing a uh, this type of guitar um so i've i've never had this type of guitar before so uh, you know a semi hollow and the kind of a bigger body like this so let's give it here's the bass line here uh this is going through a fender uh deluxe reverb it's a silver face uh emulating a 68 this is uh an all tube amp uh 22 watts uh, 12 inch speaker uh it's a jensen something and uh, i just have a little bit of the hall of fame reverb on it i wanted uh, to dial down the reverb fenders is a bit crazy sometimes uh, when you're just trying to test thing out so here is i'll just strum some chords this is the humbucker <laughs> Still getting used to the, <laughs> the uh, neck on it. So yeah, pretty good. Now let's blend it here. Uh, I'm going to put in the middle position, which is both pickups. I got everything cranked up here, uh, trying to keep it simple. Now, let's try the uh, neck pickup by itself. Yeah, I mean, not too bad. I mean, it's hard to kind of, you know, fail that. That's a pretty easy test, you, you know. Uh, Thank you. 
yeah, I mean, it's, uh, it, it plays well. Uh, as you heard, I'm still trying to get used to it. It's not quite, I'm used to playing uh, strats and the Les Paul. It's kind of a similar feel to that, of course. Um, That's, uh, you know, it's, it's got a pretty good sound. And again, I'm just plugging, uh, I'm going through, you know, a tuner and a, uh, I, I do have a, uh, a drive pedal that I'm going to get to here in a second. But I'm just going straight into the amp, not doing anything fancy with, uh, you know, EQing or anything like that. So now let's, uh, let's see what this does with a... Uh, a drive pedal. I've got uh, just got a New X uh, Plexi Crunch, and let me turn this um, uh, gain down. Sorry about that. And we'll we'll kick that on and uh, see what this thing does with uh, just a little bit of gain. I have the the gain all the way down on it and uh, master volume just past a quarter of the way. <laughs> It's, uh, it's not bad at all. Uh, that, you know, handles it pretty well. Uh, let's turn the gain up a little bit more and give this West Creek Semi-Hollow a shot here. Some higher gain. Uh-oh. Let me turn it away from the amp. Getting some... Getting some... Uh-oh. We got a microphone here? Hello. Hello. Yeah, we sure do. <laughs> all right. Getting a little bit of feedback. Uh... That's pretty good. Yeah, I mean, it's... Uh... It's just a solid, I mean, it's 180 bucks, you know? Don't want a copyright strike on there, but yeah, you can do all kinds of things for this. You know, uh, West Creek, it's an Amazon guitar. They don't make it, I'm quite certain of that. Uh, but it's pretty damn good. Again, the fit, the finish, and all that kind of, you know, crap. I, I, don't, I normally don't care about that stuff. I just, I know people do some reporting about it. But I didn't see a flaw anywhere in the paint. 
and you know the finish here I, I i didn't put it under a damn microscope or anything i just looked with my eyes i couldn't see anything uh so uh, the pickups sound good yeah it'll it'll feedback um if you if you get the gain up a little high you got to make sure you're kind of away from the amp uh but you know the, the tuners leave a bit to be desired they're kind of they're real i wouldn't say they're loose but you know they're very they're a little too easy to turn and there's not uh you know i i like it to be a bit more precise it's i you know 220 bucks what this thing's going for i can't nitpick it that much so yeah i recommend this thing especially if you're like me and I, you know, I've got a couple of American Strats. I got a Les Paul Standard and some other, you know, Squires in that. And I didn't have a semi-hollow guitar, so I figured, what the hell? Just pull the trigger. I'll do a video on it. And uh, there you go. Please uh, subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed. Uh, you know, I'm uh, I'm up to I don't know what the hell we're up to, but you know, I'd like to get to a thousand here sometime earlier in. January, not January, uh, 2023, this is, uh, this is New Year's Eve. I'm rocking it on New Year's Eve. So, please subscribe to the channel. Uh, I, I definitely would recommend this. There's another one I will say, it's called like Redid or Reddit or something, R-E-D-I-D. -E Looks exactly like this. I'm sure it's the same maker. It's actually selling cheaper, like 160 right now. No coupon needed. I think it's 159 so, uh, actually wish I would have bought that one, but, uh, no, this is fine. This is great. Recommend it. The West Creek. Uh, so please subscribe to the channel. Keep rock alive.